you can now edit conditions in the new task UI. Let's check it out. Here's a simple action, a simple flash action, where you can go uh, at the menu and then add conditions. You can see that it brings up the condition editor and you can set the conditions to whatever you like. So for example, let's try with something simple like one matches one. As you can see, the border of the condition changes to green right away because this condition is true. And back here, you can see that this condition is true and this all green, this uh, big green part back here is also true. So it means that all of the conditions are, are um, the conditions uh, operations are matched correctly. So now I can add another one and let's add a condition that is not true, something like one equal matches two. As you can see now the border is this error color and back here you can see that the full condition is now not true because something that is true and then and something that is not true uh, equals something that in the in the total condition is not true as well but for example if I change this to or you can see that it changes to true because this or this is true I can add even more conditions like Let's add another true condition, like three matches three. And now you can see that the full condition is true. But if I change this to and, and this to or, you can see that the color up here changes. Uh, for example, if I do this, oh, sorry. If I do <laughs> and up here, you can see that it's red because this and this and this all of them should be true for this to be true but if I put or here you can see now that the group is true because it goes this and this and that is not true but then all of that or this it becomes true at the end but you could set uh, you could use this or plus one which is gives it a higher precedence and this creates a group where uh, these two conditions are evaluated first and then only then this condition is evaluated so for example if I set this to 2 so it's false you can see that the condition the full condition is false but if I change this to or it is true because this and this is false and then or this it's true but if I change this to a group first it evaluates this condition so this or this is false is true but then this and true false and true is false so in the end it goes to false so this is the new condition editor you can now even drag conditions around so you could put this first one up here like this or like this so the conditions move independently from the operators here so you can now finally easily change the order of conditions in Tasker. You can also delete conditions like this and if you delete them all the action goes back to normal. So this is the new condition editor in Tasker, and I hope you enjoyed it. Bye.